Hey, what's up, YouTube land? It's your boy, Annie Hill, the White Oak, Pennsylvanian toy collector, and it's time for another Eddie Hill review. It's review time. People, the White Oak, Pennsylvania toy collector is back in the review seat, and today we'll be reviewing some random figures from the thrift store, one from eBay, and a couple things from Kennywood. So yeah, we got some random figures to review, plus some Sonic figures I got brand new. First on the bucket list, we got this sword. Reminds me of that one sword from Kingdom Hearts. I don't know what it's called exactly, but it's a star blade, which is pretty cool. And it lights up, man. Oh, that is so sweet. I love picking up these Kennywood blades. They look so cool. Definitely going to go on the shelf for sure. Next on the list, we got these figures that are pretty cool. We got this uh, panda dude. Cowboy panda. Why not? He looked pretty cool in the bins at Goodwill Outlet. Of course, we got the good old little cat girl in trousers. And the little kid... Repair man. Oh, that's that's a cute and adorable little figure, huh? Okay. Next on the list, we got these Roblox figures. I think they're Roblox. We got this kid astronaut. Why not? We got this little frog dude. Oh man, he is kooky. <laughs> we got this kid with a t-shirt on. Yeah, a unique t-shirt. It might be from Roblox for all I know. I've heard of Roblox. We got this other figure that's like a Roblox race car driver. I'm going to race for the win. Yep, couldn't help that. That was fun to mess around with. Here we got another panda guy, and he's like, yeah, I'm going to be on top of the world. You know what I mean? got this superhero Roblox. It's like, Aw, oh, man, to the rescue, up, up, and away. You know what I mean? <laughs> I have fun here on this channel making fun on this channel. I really do. Of course, next, we got a figure from my childhood. And this is Mega Cubix from Cubix. Robots for everyone. It doesn't have any knee bend or anything like that because this is a Burger King action figure. So you had to buy all the packs to build Mega Cubics up, man. But he is pretty cool. He's got some wiggle wobbly in his feet, which is pretty cool. Kick back that far. Kick front that far, which is pretty cool. His arms can do a full re 60. Like so. Not bad for an old Burger King figure. And his head moves. Ain't that awesome? So you can get some movement out of his head. That's all there is to say for Cubix. And he was a robot slash hero slash protector, man. But here's one character you're all going to be very familiar with. If you watch the movie Ice Age... When I was a kid, I watched the movie Ice Age, and this is Manny from Ice Age, man. Oh, it's awesome. Definitely gonna look good on my shelf, and he can trunk and be like, woolly mammoth stuff with the trunk. Next on the list, we got this Roblox helicopter. If you pull the wings out, he can... Be a full helicopter do, 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 do and spin like a helicopter. Why not? And we got this military Roblox here in the in the sorry correction moment in the driver's seat. My head got confused there. Sorry about that. But he can go in the driver's seat and be like chopper inbound and junk. <laughs> 
Next, we got these little vehicles we also got at the outlet in a little Ziploc, just to show you. And these are some micro machines. I think these are some vintage, little, retro micro machines from back when they were a thing. We got some military grade. We got these cheap, got this cheap and minivan. Got a couple tanks. Why not? They're tanks. We got this tank car, which is pretty cool, by all standards. Got this Jeep. I love some Jeeps, man. And we got this little troop troop car. Why not? Why not? And that's all there is to say for those little tiny micro machines. Of course, we got this at Kennywood, a Pokeball. Gotta catch them all, it's you and me. I know it's my destiny, Pokemon. Oh, you're my best friend in a world we must defend. But next for our new item, we got Jack Specific. Sonic, not Sonic, but Amy and Tails. Now the, my head got confused again, sorry about that. Good old Amy and Tails, because what's a Sonic the Hedgehog collection without Amy and Tails? And Amy's got her mallet, and Tails can walk on both his feet, which is pretty cool. And that's all there is to say for the packaging. Let's look at Amy herself. Really well articulated, and she can go smash, smash with the hammer. Bend at the knee. That's awesome that they get bends out of their knees. Kick back that far, kick back that far. Head is on a on a hinge in the ball joint, roughly, but it's a tight ball joint. We get this thing for our Sonic the Hedgehog playset, which we will be adding that to there. And we got Tails here as well. Ain't that cool? We got good old Tails in the house. He gets bend at the knee. His feet are on ball joints, nice. His head is on a tight joint. Afraid I'm gonna break him. And that's all there is to say for Tails and Amy. Probably wondering, where did I get those thrift store figures and that eBay find of Mega Cubics? Well, I got Mega Cubics from eBay and the rest of the stuff from the thrift store and these two I got on sale on good old Amazon for my Sonic collection. Would I re recommend these figures if you're a toy enthusiast like myself? Yes, they are worth the money. If you can get them for a good price, they're worth the money. And that's all there is to say for this review. And this is Eddie Hill. Moving on and rock on and rock out, YouTube land.